is. <laughs> Look who it is. It's me, y'all. It's me. So I know I've been gone for a little minute. Um, I really don't have an explanation about that. I just, you know, your girl just had to go on a hiatus. I had to go on a hiatus. So um, don't pay attention to my closet. This stuff is messy. It's so messy. But I am going to uh, fix that closet and actually put some storage in there. So y'all will be seeing that in the future. But I wanted to come here and start off this vlog just like this. Because I have no shame in my game. It is what it is. I needed a break. I needed to kind of figure out what I wanted to do, what I wanted to just, I don't know, pretty much like what was the purpose of my videos. So, y'all, I'm back. So, um, I just did a little video for my locks because as you can see, my hair is out and I just did my one year lock update and stuff like that but yeah it's gonna be a quick nice easy vlog this week because you know we're just doing a couple of things this week and i figured you know i might as well pick up my camera because i'm not gonna be able to um if i picked up my camera because i said to myself if I want to make youtube videos if i want to be serious about my business i need to do what I love but at the same time what makes me frustrated and sometimes filming and recording is what I love to do I love to make YouTube videos but I get frustrated because I don't really get the views and the algorithm and the numbers that I'm looking for so sometimes it really does make me feel like what's the purpose of doing this stuff but we're not even gonna talk about that I already prayed about it I'm seeking counsel and we're gonna move forward okay so let's keep going <laughs> guys i got new packages i got new stuff uh, okay so my shower shelf just came i ended up getting two more because i have one already in my bathroom so boom this already came in the shower shelf and my cosmetic storage which i'm not using for cosmetics i'm gonna use it for my perfume tray let's see how this works i'm gonna build it and i'm gonna show y'all how i build it oh you guys when i ended up getting this shelf i really wanted something that i can move these perfumes over to something a little bit bigger as you can tell this is my old perfume shelf i bought this this is the first shelf i ever bought and y'all it's cute but it just doesn't go for what i'm trying to redo rebuild for this bathroom um don't mind this nasty behind soap dispenser y'all when i tell you we are revamping this bathroom we are going to revamp this bathroom okay so this is some of the perfume that i have and i just want to move it to a bigger shelf because i did end up getting some new perfumes and i just want something more aesthetically pleasing something more cute and honestly something with more space and um compact you know little areas so let's check it out let's see if it's worth it and yeah y'all gonna watch me build it love you give you can't be replaced so no one else I'm to do that's why I'm honest and my love for chills I won't feed you anywhere I can I won't share my world world don't you understand my love is on one in a million it goes on I am so in love with my perfume tray, y'all. I just got this perfume tray and I made it. Um, yeah, so this is the final look to that perfume tray, y'all. And I am so in love with this perfume tray. Like, it looks so pretty. I posted it on TikTok and I just love it. Like, I fell in love with this. So you guys, meal prepping is done for lunch this week. I have orange chicken with cauliflower and rice. You guys know I love my cauliflower rice. It's just healthy and it tastes better, honestly. Like I'm eating my cauliflower rice so much that like I prefer to eat that over rice. But yeah, this is what I'm having for lunch for the week. So I'm done with that and I'm so happy about it. 
hey guys good morning so i'm starting to vlog off right here um it's early it's not that early actually it's like nine o'clock and i figured i might as well turn on the camera um so me and og are getting ready to head to north carolina it's the next day so we're getting ready to um i don't know i just been like trying to like oh I put too much blush right here on my cheek. I can tell. Like, it's just like one spot. <laughs> you guys, it's been so hard to hide OG's cake, okay? Like, I'm trying so hard not to let him see that I got him his surprise. But, it happens. Um, I've been hiding the cake all day yesterday. Like, I got it last night. So, I've been hiding it all night. <laughs> like, like not really I just put it in the freezer and then he went to go get his Red Bull out the freezer so I had to remove the cake and put it in my bag it's been a lot of just tossing around that cake okay but long story short I think we're gonna be successful with the surprise because I don't really think he knows I don't think he, I think he has a little inclination but I don't think he knows we have a few snacks in the back back here and yeah we're good we're just ready to hit the road and stuff like that so i think we'll be okay for the most part but yeah hey guys so we arrived we're here at the hotel right now and we just kind of took a little break or whatever um but yes guys we arrived in charlotte and so far you know we're excited to see what it looks like i'm excited to see what charlotte's about i've been to north carolina but i always went to greensboro so this is the first time i'm ever in charlotte and i'm excited let's see how it is it's nothing really special about the hotel, but I could just show you guys, you know, keep it kind of, you know, cliche, I guess. And I'll just show you guys the hotel. You're going to see, like, our luggages, but just ignore that. So, yeah, our hotel is it's pretty decent. So, I'll just start off with the living room area. So, we have a cute little living room area style. Um, I don't know where the lights are, but... Let me see if that okay. We have the kitchen area, nice little area. Doop. <laughs> so um coming over here. Then we have this little office area. We have the TV. We have the bed right here. And bathroom. And the bathroom mirror and the bathroom closet. So yeah, this is our hotel and it's cozy what do you rate this oh gee what do you rate this hotel seven. a seven yeah it does give me it what do you think could be better like what do you mean like the view maybe the TV be. oh right in front of us yeah the tv is like on the side of where the bed is which is kind of weird but i guess it's good because you could angle out the tv I don't know. It's too early to tell what Charlotte's going to be like. But one thing I can say right now, they have a whole lot of damn trees. <laughs> like Atlanta has a lot of trees. Charlotte has a lot of trees. And I have to get used to seeing trees because I'm not used to seeing trees. Like in Florida, we don't have all these bushes. So sometimes it's, <laughs> sometimes it's a challenge to kind of like see all these trees. Because I'm like, it's blocking the view. But it's whatever. I just have to get adjusted to it, right? So yeah, we're here. Um, I'm gonna pull up the camera most likely when we go to the restaurant to eat because we're gonna eat right now. Um, OG wanted to go to the museum. Huh? Levine Museum. What's it called? L-E-V-I-N-E. Living Museum? Mm -hmm. He wanted to go to the museum out here but they close at five o'clock so we're not gonna make that for today but we may um, go tomorrow, most likely, because he's excited about going to the museum. And, yeah. So, we're going to do the museum tomorrow. I wanted to try out this restaurant. 
I mean, yeah, it's like this outdoor place where like the river is flowing and you can actually like have dinner and activities on the side. I'll put like the name up here on the screen if I could remember what the location is, but I don't know. This weather isn't looking too amazing, guys. The weather looks kind of, you know, shabby. So I don't know if we're going to be able to go out there and eat because of the weather, but I'm not going to overthink it. There's still other things to do in Charlotte, so yeah. We were just driving by and we decided to just take a look at what Charlotte has to offer us, right? <laughs> so, it looks nice downtown. I like downtown. It looks lively. So, that's what we're kind of looking for. But the food was good. What do you number the food, OG? One to ten. Five. A five. He didn't like the shrimp, you guys. He said the shrimp wasn't fully cooked and he was right because and he kept asking the hostess is the shrimp cooked all the way is it cooked oh that's how he said it and she was like yes yeah, the food cooked but the food wasn't cooked to his expectation but honestly i will say the food the shrimp wasn't that great it wasn't that great of a seafood but it was all right it was all right but we're down here and yeah we chilling so I'm gonna have my camera out. I might have my phone out because, you know, it just depends. But yeah, we're gonna take you guys along with us. I wanna take OG on one of these, but I don't know if they'll do it. So, Mellow Marsh Mushroom. I don't know what that is. I'm So, this is their little area. That's where we're heading off to. I'm Pamela Brown. So See you tomorrow at this time. Down. CNN News Home. Aaron Burnett up front starts right now. my camera to set up hey guys good morning good morning <laughs> good morning guys what's up so we are up today you guys we are here in um charlotte i almost forgot where we were but we're here in charlotte me and the boo decided that we we're gonna go to a museum over here so that's what we decided to do um, we're just trying to like figure out things to do in Charlotte. I don't know. I don't know if it's that I wasn't watching enough TikTok. I tried to find things on TikTok, but the weather did um, change the plans for us, what we were originally going to do. So now we're just here, like at the museum area, I guess you want to say. We're here at the museum. Um, guys. It's that type of vlog. I'm not even going to front. <laughs> it's the type of vlog like it's not that much going on. Um, 
we're really rooting for Charlotte. And I don't know because maybe because I've been to different cities and stuff like that in North Carolina. I had a different experience. I don't know. But Charlotte, it's just... I don't know, y'all. I just don't know if Charlotte's really giving. <laughs> Pretty much. I'm trying to say, I don't know if Charlotte's really giving. So, yeah. Anyways, but we're here in Charlotte. We're going to see what it's about. We're here at the museum. Um, hopefully, I'm po most likely I'm not going to be able to film, but I'm going to use my phone, period. So, I'm going to pull out my phone and record some of the clips that you'll see in the museum and stuff. Just so when you're here in Charlotte, you can actually have something to do, too. Um, if you're here and you're just trying to figure out what to do, I mean, you know, you can use this video as a reference. But, it's a good day. It's a good vibe. You know, the sun is not out, but it's still not raining. So, to me, that's a good day. I don't know about y'all, but yeah, we're just going to chill and, you know, enjoy ourselves. And I'm excited. I'm excited uh, for everything. Baby, are you excited for the museum? Mm -hmm. He's excited for the museum. This was his choice. So, you know, we're going to have fun because this was his choice.